Dan here. It's uh, like Tricky Dan's dirty used cars. Well, the Bisqueen, she's going away. Man, you guys have been relentless in the comments there. So uh, y'all picked a winner. They're on their way. And uh, this thing's been sitting here. We actually just lost the keys again. Just found them. They're supposed to be here in about 12 minutes. Um, emptying all my uh, tow truck stuff out of it. Because I still don't have that. Which is a story for another day. Um, Wait, do they know that in the garage is in the garage? Uh, we'll probably have to put that video out after this one. Yeah, or before. It. Yeah, well this one will come out after them. Um, what are you going to say there? So we have to get it running. Someone stole the battery out of this thing. Um, by someone you mean you. Yes, that was me. How do I pop the hood? Oh, yeah, there it is. So... Wants his startomatic back. Oh, yeah, Mer wants his starting machine. So we'll take that. And this. Oh, yeah, we got to run. Huh. Do have to get the coil going. And I got to find a battery. What do I put it in? Hmm. Hmm. Oh, yeah. No, there's, no, there's nothing in the Nova right now. It's ripped apart. Um, My car? It might be in something. We'll figure something out to get this thing fired up. Get a little gas dumped on the carburetor. I just want to move it over in the whatever. Maybe Daniel wash it or something like that. Be a real gem. Nope. No. All right. Well, we tried. We tried. Yeah, I can't oh, the battery's probably in the, in this garage car though. I'll just grab it. Battery found. Yeah, I did a couple of funny things here, but I think it'll work. I'm hoping. So what gotta, funny things have you done? Well, we're using a top post on a side post. You know what? A free battery is free battery. If it works, even better. If it works, even better. That didn't work. Shoot. We fired up with the key at one point, didn't we? Uh-huh. What's going on there? It's never ending. Okay. Do the headlights work? Yep. Okay, that's weird. Why, uh, why is this? Make a noise. Yeah, it's the fan. Well then, that's a unique set of problems. What'll do it? Uh, didn't exactly have the starter wire. The trigger wire hooked up. It appears to be missing a screw. Yeah, it's a fixer upper. Okay, so that'll work. We need like a pair of vice grips or something. Tiny set. This is really inconvenient where everything is here. I gotta grab some tools. <laughs> a little, little bit custom here. But I think it'll be good. The trigger wire, I guess when I put it in there, didn't have a screw or lost a screw or something. So we'll see if it'll roll over with that battery if it's dead. Hopefully not. Perfect. Starter seems a little angry. Now we need coil power. Where is it getting that from? Oh, right here. Like it's like ready to go. What? No. Or had something else plugged in there. Okay. That's good. Probably should have started this like a couple of days ago or something. Eh? Not the day of. Cobwebs all over and stuff. Make sure I'll go. 
kind of runs okay. And I have a lot of tools in this thing. Right, it seems to be running uh, as good as it's going to. Got a bit of a miss. It's probably fine though. It's got gears. Let's see if we can sound it to Danny. Cup, couple of things the throttle actually stuck second of all it, it moved some gravel i think oh yeah we dug a little gravel you might want to put a, a spring on that or so if it doesn't have one that was a little intense luckily it's running so bad that it wasn't a problem oh yeah there's no return spring that is not good so uh they're on their way I'm sure we'll do some filming once they're here, but just to reiterate one more time, you know, we build a lot of cars and I really don't have a whole lot of use for them. This is just kind of a fun project. Um, and, and really selling, I hate selling cars. So this way it's going to a good home. I, I hope anyways, that we're going to a good home, but uh, it's definitely far from a perfect car, but for $1, what can you expect, right? So it's a 66, Biscayne, I bought last year, last summer. It's a four-door sedan, plain Jane. And uh, I two-door converted it. So, you know, just kind of to see if I could. And, and it, honestly, it looks much like a regular two-door Biscayne would, I believe, as far as I'm concerned, in the two I've seen in real life. Um, I had a big block in it and a Turbo 400. And I thought, oh, this would be cool. We'll do a bunch of stuff with it. I don't really know what the plan was. Anyways, we put a motor the camshaft and headers and all this stuff to it. It has a, like I said, 400, it actually has a way too high stall in it and a 12 bolt. I thought it'd be kind of a cool sleeper, you know, street bruiser. And then we graded the uh, camshaft, it ate a, ate a lifter. And that was like right at the end of the year last year. And I think I literally, we put the small block in it just to get it running. It was like basically ready to go in for inspection and everything. It needed a few little things, but it was done. And then I gave up and it stayed actually at MERS all winter. And I totally forgot about it. And then in the spring, I was like, oh yeah, I got to deal with this thing. He wanted it out of there. And I was like, let's just get it gone. So we did the little, you know, if you want it, make a video thing. So that's where we ended up. So again, as is no warranty binding, but it's got a lot of good stuff on it. The whole front end is brand new. It's all stock, but all new bushings, the shocks. I believe I did all the brakes to it. It's all drum and single, single pot master, but everything's new. It looks like... Yeah, oh yeah, new new brake line, new everything. It's actually got a real fancy aluminum radiator, which I, I really should have kept. That's for, uh, that's a Camaro uh, aluminum rad. This motor I had, oh, and these Moroso valve covers are actually really nice too. I've had those a long time. I really should have done a better job of this. It's got a brawler carb on it, HEI small block with a bit of a cam. It runs poorly. This motor I've had for a long time, and I don't quite know what it was out. I think it might have been in the Nova for a while, and I, when I put a big block in, I took it out. But I mean, it's fine. Um, what else do I do to it? I mean, it's got gauges, but I mean, it, it's a it's solid underneath. The quarter panels are rough, no bones about that. But it's a good little car. Everything works, lights work. It's a good cruiser. So, yeah, it'd be a it'd be a good first car or second car or third car for somebody. But it's kind of neat. It has its little quirks, but honestly, I don't think it needs that much. It'd be perfect for like an LS swap or something along those lines. But yeah, I'm gonna clean up just a little bit, I guess, and wait for them to show up. And then uh, sign the title and take it away. Sounds like a pretty good day. Maybe we'll go for lunch after. Ready. Jackson got the car. <laughs> <laughs> so we've told him what it is. He gets it. His parents are here, so they, they're like, they know what the deal is. So they drove from like South Carolina, North Carolina? North Carolina. North Carolina. And the best part is they said now we can buy things down there and store it at their place. So now 
the Facebook marketplace has expanded yet another state or two. So I don't know what their plan is with this, but I told them to low down on it, what it all it has, and uh, check out his shirt. He's got his own deal. So you got a channel and all you're gonna start with it or what? Oh yeah, we're gonna try to start a channel with it. Don't try, do just do it. What? <laughs> you know what's okay. more important in high school? YouTube channels. <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry, you'll, I made I made it through high school first try and I was on a hot rod, so you'll probably be the same. Oh, must have. But yeah, so I don't know, we're gonna kind of play around with it a little bit, see what it is, we can fire it up. Oh, you wanna start it? Sure. Oh, sorry. The keys are in it, we lost the keys today, yet again. <laughs> but they're in it now. They're in it now, okay. <laughs> I, I've seen the videos where... We did find the key. <laughs> we can hotwire it, we got, we got the ability if we have to. Starter might need shimmy. Jackson, tell us what what are the plans? What are we doing with it? Oh, uh, I think first thing is to get rid of the little mouse motor in it. We're gonna put a rat in it, you know, 454, may, maybe even 496 if I can figure out how to build that. that the that's bank of mom has lots of money, I heard. Yeah, no, none, none of that goes into the hot rods. It's all my stuff. You're gonna have to mow a lot of grass for a big block. I am, yeah. No, I'm stoked you got it, man. Like, my, I always want like the next, like, I used to, oh, I still feel like I'm the younger guy when I go to car shows and stuff like that, but I'm glad there's actually some young people who are in the hot rods. So that's cool. In fact, this guy's kind of stay on. Oh, yeah. that might fall down there. It's just held over the ratchet strap. But I'm pretty stoked you got it, buddy. I can't. <laughs> oh, the it's only amazing. thing, I want to make a deal with you. Now it's your car. Yeah. I really want the hubcaps. You really want the hubcaps? Can I buy them from you for $1,000? <laughs> I'm serious. Are you being, you're all, yeah, you're being I serious. Hubcaps. I thought you yeah, were no, being I got a funny. No, 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 I want them. And you have know, to pay for your travel home or, or towards the whatever you want to do. And also, like, an apology for selling you this car. What? <laughs> yeah. But I want the hubcaps. You want the hubcaps? Oh, that's U.S. dollars, too. Oh, There's... that's U.S. dollars. Okay, for $1,000, I think that you can have the hubcaps. Sweet. <laughs> We're, I feel like I got a deal today. Yeah. <laughs> and you can put that towards headers on your big block Chevy. Yeah, I mean. Oh. Well, yeah, you yeah. have a dollar. Here we yeah. go. One American dollar. <laughs> I want you to notice that's a one one dollar. You so, gotta sign this one though. I guess. So. <laughs> we got a mark here. Hold on. What's your YouTube channel gonna be, Jackson? It's Lucky Jack Racing. Uh, I think it's on the shirt. Yeah, Lucky Jack Racing on the shirt. Instagram, YouTube. We we have a little third gen Camaro next to Bisquick that we call Jackpot. That thing is uh, it's interesting. <laughs> I think that you should go watch it. Fall on its face. <laughs> It's fun. He's pretty good. I like this kid. <laughs> oh, is this like the first autograph? This is. Oh, I'm honored. So when you're the big guy on YouTube, don't forget about us, eh? Oh, never. We'll ask for shout out. <laughs> this is part of the deal. This was part of the deal. Okay. And we have, have a bumper sticker from Power Tour and a big old piece of black glass. And the bolt shows through a back row, so if anyone's got a stack of watches, we'll get it in. Let's see where we're going to put this. It'll drive on to the trailer. Yeah, yeah. and get it. <laughs> see if I can get it unstuck. It's okay, we'll just wait. We'll yeah. just wait here. While we're the hardest part of getting the car home is putting the bumper sticker yeah, Oh, yeah. <laughs> we're going to let mom have this. <laughs> Co-host right here, guys. Yeah. She helps me out. Oh, look at that. 
But like, if the car like breaks down or burns up, just rip that right off. Just rip that right off. We don't need to know where it came from. Got it, always. <laughs> so, they came bearing gifts. That was the best dollar I ever got. <laughs> Chapel Hill Talkie. Rum cake, ooh. Blister fried peanuts. Man, these are all things we never would have heard of. I love trying foods. <laughs> oh, those are the best. Yeah. Those yeah. Classic. This one's been open. They must have got hungry on the way. Hot stuff. Thanks, guys. Oh, oh moon God. pies. Like legit moon oh, pies. Yeah, yeah, really <gasps> Fun. Man. We get to test how this handles against sparks and stuff. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Thanks, dude. And I'm excited to see how many like welding like holes get into your shirt and stuff. Maybe not that and... shirt. Not this one, but there <laughs> are a few that. that no, no welding into polyester. Safety third. Safety third, <laughs> always. I'm putting them to work to take the hubcaps off. They're pretty good. So the deal is you can't spend the money on anything smart or responsible. He has to waste the money on. <laughs> I promise you're gonna waste the money on something stupid for a hot rod. Oh, always. <laughs> oh yeah, I tried to do a burn out there and dug it in a little on accident. All is fine. I still own the cart for time. So. <laughs> if you have a little muscle, now the camera's on. It's yeah, embarrassing, yeah. eh? This, now it's gonna get stuck. You want, you want your mom to help her? <laughs> <laughs> Not I will say he got all the other ones off real quick. Uh -huh. This last one's just a struggle bus. It doesn't want to go. Yeah. There we go. Success. Oh, and now it's raining. Yeah. Perfect timing. Perfect Woo. timing. <laughs> Are you going to miss it? I kind of like this thing. We didn't even get to make out the back or nothing. Shoot. <laughs> this thing's cool. Actually, it's pretty tough in the back. See, you're in the room. Uh, I feel like I should say it's for your mom, but a car is not a bedroom on wheels. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, no, no. Back seats cause bad problems. <laughs> oh my gosh. Well, it's rained. It's the end of the day, so uh, Jackson and his family was here. They're, they, uh, they've they since left. They're gonna come back tomorrow and grab this thing with a trailer. Um, we might be at work, unfortunately, so they wanted to come by and see everything and, and all that, so that's pretty cool. You know, I can't be happier for the fact that, that Jackson's getting this car. Um, if you could give a car away to a kid who's gonna, you know, he wants to keep it forever and enjoy it and all those sort of things. Just couldn't be a better family for this thing to go to. I mean, I know it's rough. I know it's not anything super special, but he was stoked about it. His old man was stoked about it. They made shirts already? They made shirts. Like, they're going to do a YouTube channel. Like, the whole deal. And I just think, like, that's awesome. And I'm happy to be, like, this part, small part of uh, what he's got going on. So, hopefully he'll kind of carry out the car they talk about putting a big block chevy in it and and who knows what i did steal the hubcaps off of it but i feel like i paid him enough for it so i mean it kind of works out okay uh dog dish hubcaps you can really never have too many of them as far as i'm concerned but uh yeah this thing's going to live its life and in, in uh, north carolina it won't see any more snow won't be left out a, you know abandoned won't get dd speed chopped anymore so yeah anyways i'm super excited to follow it so happy those guys made the trip up 
and we you know we hung out in the car a little bit you guys have been asking like crazy in the comments about the thing so it is gone this is our last night with it and uh ultimately there's now a free spot to buy another car thanks for watching enjoy the channel all those things and uh thanks for being so supportive we'll see you in the next one You're just supposed to walk out of frame